Hey, what is up you guys? It is currently 3.51 in the morning. I have been awake for probably 50 minutes. I cannot sleep. Um, I went to bed pretty early and we're actually going on an early morning hike today in about an hour. So I wanted to go and to go out for a run. Now, I don't run usually. I hate running, but I figured I want to get some more cardio in because I keep eating so much rice here in Japan. And I need to, I need to do more physical activity while I'm here in Japan. So I'm gonna go for a run right now. Early morning update number one. I have not seen a single person on this road. I'm literally just walking in the middle of the street. I can see very far down and there's literally no one on the road here at 4 a.m. Cause why would you be on the road here at 4 a.m.? Current update. I've been running for about 20 minutes. This is by far the stupidest thing I've ever done. I hate running so much. Morning, Steve. Morning. What time is it now? 5.30? 5.30. 30. 5.30 a.m. Steve, we've made it. Early in the morning. Oh, is this a fox shrine? Yeah. Look at these things. This one's got like a knife blade in his mouth. What? Can you guys see that? He's holding like a dagger. This is the most epic fox I've ever seen. We have to start this hike before anyone else does. There might be some people up there. There's a couple of people here. It's now 6 a.m. and we're starting the day off strong. About to do a three hour hike. The infamous Red Shrine Gate that I've been waiting for all my life. <laughs> Ever since I was born. Check this out. This is where it splits. You can go, actually you can't go the left way because that's for the people coming down. But this is what I have always wanted to see. This fox right here. So right now, Right now we're trying to walk a little faster to get ahead because there's people that keep coming. So it's like, I thought this place was gonna be dead empty, but it's like 6, 6.15 right now. So there are people starting to show up. Um, they had the idea that we did. <laughs> but I'm trying to get a little farther ahead so that we can get the cool pictures. For some reason all the foxes have these little red scarves. I'm not exactly sure why though. It just looks like a bunch of cool ruins inside this forest. It's the local trail cat. Don't come around these parts if you're not looking to fight. Just stand still. Don't breathe. Stand still. So there's boars in these parts, huh? That could be interesting. We are getting there. We can finally see a little bit of the city. The one thing you don't usually see on every hike is a vending machine every 10 feet. I think we've lucked out that Japan is very, very caring and they have vending machines everywhere. You can literally go on a hike anywhere in Japan. In the woods you'll probably find a vending machine. Yeah. Kind of reminds me of that graveyard in New Orleans we went to. Huh. This is how people die out here, Steve. They get eaten. Because we just came from this path and you can either go that way, that way, or this way. She's not just a stupid boulder. She's a rock. Oh, the used to ride these babies for miles. For the past 30 minutes, we've been sitting at this rock right here. Just this little rock because the sun has been coming in perfectly. It looks like an enchanted forest out there. And this rock right here is just perfect. We're getting into some hidden tumble kind of stuff. Look at this fox.
I seriously feel like I'm in Indiana Jones right now, Steve. We have found some lost temples. We're gonna have to watch out for booby traps around here. Yeah, like that one right there. Like that spike. You know, I was thinking today, I didn't get around to doing the Stairmaster, but luckily, you know, yeah, we have the all natural, all natural made by Mother Earth Stairmaster. <laughs> Mother Earth stairs. A couple hours into the hike, it's getting very warm and tiring doing all these stairs. I'm taking this all off once I get to the top. <laughs> it is, it's warm out here. I think we did it. Hey, number 14, you are here at the summit. It's like we climbed a mountain, it looks like. That's what it feels like, too. I think this is one of the best in Japan. I think so too. That's why everyone comes here. Yeah. This is it. The top temple. We started this hike at about 6 a.m. Uh, with all of our picture taking, it took us till 8 a.m. to get up here. It's about a two hour hike, not as long as I thought actually, so it wasn't that bad. Uh, the Grand Canyon was much harder. I definitely recommend it if you can. Just look at this place. We did it. I'm still kind of sad that we didn't see any boars. I was waiting to fight one. I was, I, was, gonna... I was waiting to see you fight one. Yeah, I was, I was gonna record. I was gonna be, like, yo, viral. <laughs> viral video. If I fought a boar on this trip, that would have been cool. I feel like after today, my legs are gonna be jacked, guys. I did that whole run this morning, and then this whole two-hour up hike up all these stairs. I can already feel my calves burning right now. And this is only 9 a.m. Just imagine an hour or two. Act natural. You just gotta act like a tourist and you'll, you'll be okay. True, true. Can I be in the vlog? Yeah, dude, what's up? Yeah, <laughs> so as you guys can tell, it is much later. Uh, pretty much I went home, took a nap, and uh, did some editing. I still have to do a lot more editing tonight, actually. But Steve and I have come out to this ramen shop here, and uh, we're gonna get some ramen, and uh, basically head in for the night. That is it for today. Uh, I wanna give a notification shout out to Wesley Can Contrell. Thank you, Wesley, for having my notifications on. If you would like a shout out, just press that little bell button down below and you'll be notified. Also, thank you to everyone on Patreon who has been donating. Thank you, it helps out so much. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow.